Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve a problem based on the homogeneous differential equation of Euler type, which is also known as the Cauchy Euler type. Here, we see the homogeneous differential equation with variable coefficient. By giving substitution, we are going to convert this into a constant coefficient. So, let's take x is equal to e power z or z is equal to log x. By using this, we have x into d as d dash and x square d square as d dash into d dash minus 1. Now substituting this in the question, we get d dash into d dash minus 1 minus d dash plus 1 whole bracket into y equal to log x is z and 1 by x but this can be replaced as e power z then we have whole square now multiplying this we get d dash square minus d dash minus d dash plus 1 into y and this term is e power 2z when I square it and when I carry it to the numerator e power minus 2z into z square now this part is d dash square minus 2 d dash plus 1 into y equal to e power minus 2 z into z square. As the first part of solving, we have to write the auxiliary equation which is m square minus 2 m plus 1 equal to 0 and m minus 1 whole square equal to 0. From this we get two values for m both are 1 and using this we can write the complementary function which is c1 e power m1 z so we have to write 1 z so let's write z and c2 we'll write the general form then we'll multiply it inside so c1 plus c2 z into e power m z which is 1 z and now we have to replace the z so c1 plus c2 into log x whole bracket into x now coming to the particular integral we have e power minus 2z into z square on the right hand side e power minus 2z into z square and in the denominator we have to write the d dash square minus 2d dash plus 1 whole divided by d dash square minus 2 d dash plus 1. Now wherever d dash is there, we have to replace it with d dash minus 2. The value of a is minus 2 from this power. So numerator we write as it is and coming to the denominator, we have to write d dash as d dash minus 2 whole square minus 2 into d dash minus 2 then plus 1. Now the numerator once again as it is and denominator we have to expand. This is d dash square minus 4 d dash plus 4 minus 2 d dash plus 4 plus 1. Now e power minus 2 z into z square whole divided by d dash square minus 6 d dash then 4 plus 4 plus 1 totally plus 9. Now we have to take the 9 common from the denominator. So e power minus 2z into z square when 9 is common this will become d dash square minus 6 d dash by 9 plus 1 and this entire term we are going to carry to the numerator so e power minus 2z into z square into 1 plus d dash square minus 6 d dash by 9 whole power minus 1 and we have 9 in the denominator now we are going to expand this using the formula 1 plus x whole power minus 1 which is 1 minus x plus x square minus x cube plus dot 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 this entire term is like x and it is 
twice differentiable the z square. So this all the other power we can ignore. So anyway, first term e power minus 2z into z square by 9 open bracket. Now 1 minus x is minus of d dash square minus 6 d dash by 9. Then this square I have to write plus d dash square minus 6 d dash by 9 whole square. All the other higher powers we can ignore. So now bracket close. Now outside term e power minus 2z into z square by 9. Here 1 and this term let's keep as it is d dash square minus 6 d dash by 9. And here using a minus b whole square but we need only square term. So this if I square a square will become d dash power 4 we don't want. And 2ab term will become 2 into d dash square into 6 d dash. I will get d cube, d dash q term which I don't want. And the last term will be plus 36 by 81 d dash square. Because when I multiply z square, only this will have a number other than the higher power will give 0. So all the higher power we ignored. So now it is e power minus 2z by 9 bracket open z square into 1 is z square here if I differentiate twice I get 2 divided by 9 here I have to differentiate once but before that we have 6 by 9 into d dash into z square is 2z then plus 36 by 81 into twice if I differentiate 2z and into 2 bracket close now we have e power minus 2z by 9 this is z square and minus we can write the z term first so plus this can be cancelled with 3 table 2 times 3 times so 4 by 3 z then this can be cancelled with 9 table 9 4 times 9 9 times so it is 8 by 9 this is minus 2 by 9 so 8 by 9 minus 2 by 9 is 6 by 9 which is 2 by 3 and we have to replace everything in terms of x so e power z whole power minus 2 so e power z is x x power minus 2 I will bring it to the denominator as x square then this is log x whole square then 4 by 3 log x then 2 by 3. Now we have to write the complete solution y is equal to cf plus pi. So y equal to cf already we have written in the starting which is c1 plus c2 log x into x. So c1 plus c2 log x into x plus this rest of the terms are this pi that is 1 by 9 x square bracket open log x whole square plus 4 by 3 log x plus 2 by 3.